Top 10 Fascinating Facts About Orangutans Dive into the intriguing world of orangutans, where intelligence meets emotion. From nest building to complex communication, these primates teach us the value of wildlife and the importance of protecting it. Discover their most fascinating secrets in our upcoming video. Number 10. The Daily Nests Orangutans demonstrate astonishing skill and dexterity in building nests, a daily practice that reflects their intelligence and ability to use the natural environment to their advantage. Each night, individuals of these species build nests in the treetops, carefully selecting branches and foliage which they intertwine and compact to create a secure and comfortable platform. This task is not trivial. It involves choosing the right tree, location within the tree, and type of construction material, suggesting a deep knowledge of their forest habitat. Nest building not only serves for resting but is also a survival strategy. Elevated from the ground, orangutans protect themselves from terrestrial predators and minimize their exposure to various parasites and diseases. Additionally, nests provide relative protection against the elements, such as rain and wind. This nest-building behavior is one of many examples of how orangutans interact with their environment in complex and meaningful ways. Research has shown that orangutans do not build a nest randomly or monotonously. They exhibit preferences for certain types of trees and forest regions, and nest construction can vary depending on the season or weather. This demonstrates an ability to adapt and plan, aspects that highlight their intelligence. Interestingly, young orangutans learn the art of nest building by observing and emulating adults, which is a clear example of knowledge and culture transmission within the orangutan community. Nest building has also caught the attention of scientists as an indicator of forest health. By monitoring the frequency and location of nests, researchers can gain valuable information about the orangutan population, their distribution and movements, as well as the general health of the forest ecosystem they inhabit. This knowledge is crucial for conservation efforts, as it provides essential data for the planning of protected areas and habitat restoration. Number 9. Impressive Longevity Orangutans have one of the longest lifespans among non-human primates, reflecting the complexities of their biology and the effectiveness of their survival strategies in natural environments and under human care. In their natural habitat, these majestic creatures can live up to 30 to 40 years, a significant lifespan that allows them to go through long periods of learning and socialization, essential for the transmission of knowledge and skills within their community. This extensive phase of growth and development underscores the complexity of their societies and the depth of their familial and social relationships. Under human care, in zoos and rescue centers, orangutans can live beyond 50 years. This increase in lifespan is attributed to the absence of predators, regular veterinary care, and a balanced and consistent diet. However, this fact also highlights the importance of providing an enriching environment that stimulates their mind and body, replicating the challenges and complexity of their natural surroundings to maintain their physical and mental well-being. The longevity of orangutans also poses significant challenges for their conservation. Given that females give birth to only one baby every 8 to 10 years, the reproduction rate of these primates is exceptionally low. This slow reproductive cycle means that orangutan populations are particularly vulnerable to threats that reduce their numbers, such as deforestation, poaching, and the illegal animal trade. Therefore, every individual is vital for the long-term survival of their species. Moreover, the longevity of orangutans underscores the depth of their experiences and relationships. With decades of life, these primates develop strong social bonds, learn complex skills to interact with their environment, and possibly accumulate extensive knowledge about their habitat. Research has shown that adult orangutans are more adept at finding and using food resources, suggesting that, like humans, they accumulate knowledge and skills throughout their life. 
This impressive lifespan is not only a testament to the resilience of orangutans against the challenges of their environment but also a reminder of our duty to protect them and preserve their habitats. The survival of orangutans is intrinsically linked to the health of the tropical forests they inhabit, and their preservation is essential not only for their future but also for the well-being of these complex ecosystems. Number 8. Solitary by Nature Orangutans are known for their tendency to lead fairly solitary lives, a distinctive feature that sets them apart from other great apes, such as gorillas and chimpanzees, who live in complex social groups. This solitary tendency is particularly noticeable in adult males, who prefer to roam alone, maintaining vast territories that they defend from other males. However, this solitary nature does not imply that orangutans are asocial. Interactions do occur, though less frequently, mainly during mating season or at abundant feeding sites, where food is sufficient to attract several individuals. Females, on the other hand, are constantly accompanied by their offspring, whom they raise and teach survival skills over several years. This prolonged period of dependency is crucial for the transmission of essential knowledge, such as food location, nest building, and tool use. The strong mother-offspring relationship underscores the importance of family ties in orangutan society, contrasting with their reputation for being solitary. The solitary nature of orangutans is also adapted to their environment. The forests of Borneo and Sumatra, where they reside, offer dispersed resources that could not sustain large social groups sustainably. This dispersion of resources has led to an evolutionary adaptation where a solitary lifestyle is more efficient for survival. By roaming alone, orangutans can maximize their food intake without the intense competition they would face in larger groups. Additionally, their solitary nature has fostered an impressive level of independence and self-sufficiency. Orangutans are renowned for their intelligence and problem-solving ability, attributes that are essential for an animal that spends most of its life alone. They are capable of remembering the location of fruit trees and planning their daily foraging routes, a complex cognitive ability that demonstrates their capacity to adapt and thrive in their environment. Despite their tendency for solitude, orangutans maintain a complex network of recognition and long-distance communication. They use long and powerful calls to communicate, especially males, who emit long-distance calls to attract females and warn other males. This communication system underscores that, although they prefer to live alone, orangutans are not disconnected from their community. Instead, they have developed strategies to interact in a balance between solitude and socialization, adapted to the demands of their environment. Number 7. Sophisticated Communicators Orangutans are distinguished by their impressive communication repertoire, which includes a variety of sounds, gestures, and facial expressions. Despite their predominantly solitary nature, these communicative skills are fundamental for interacting with other members of their species in various situations, such as parenting, mating, and territory defense. The complexity of their communication reflects the depth of their intelligence and the sophistication of their social interactions. One of the most fascinating aspects of orangutan communication is their use of vocalizations. With around 20 different types of calls, they can express a range of messages, from warnings about predators to invitations for mating. These vocalizations vary significantly in tone, volume, and duration, allowing orangutans to convey specific and nuanced information. For example, the long-distance calls emitted by males not only serve to attract females but also to warn other males of their presence, thereby establishing their territorial dominance without the need for physical confrontation. In addition to vocalizations, orangutans use a series of gestures and facial expressions to communicate, especially for situations that require closer or more intimate interaction, such as between mothers and offspring or between potential mates. These gestures can include hand signaling, specific grimacing, or intentional body movements. 
The ability to communicate desires, intentions, and emotions through gestures is indicative of their advanced cognition and complex social life. Facial communication is equally important. Orangutans are capable of expressing a wide range of emotions through their facial expressions, from joy to sadness or anger. The ability to convey complex emotions is crucial for the formation of social bonds and the maintenance of relationships within their community, although dispersed. Interestingly, research has shown that orangutans are also capable of using tools as a means of communication. For example, they have been observed using sticks to make noise and attract attention or modifying their environment in ways that communicate specific messages to others. The ability to use tools not only for practical problem solving but also as a form of expression underscores the flexibility and creativity of their communicative behavior. The sophistication of communication in orangutans not only is a testament to their intelligence but also highlights the importance of preserving their natural habitats. A deep understanding of these complex forms of communication is crucial for conservation efforts, as it provides insights into their social behavior, needs, and the way they interact with their environment. As we continue to uncover the riches of their communicative world, the invaluable value of these extraordinary beings and the ethical imperative to protect them become evident. Number 6. A large percentage of DNA shared with humans. Orangutans share approximately 97% of their DNA with humans, a genetic proximity that places them in the inner circle of our closest living relatives, alongside chimpanzees and bonobos. This remarkable genetic similarity highlights not only our common evolutionary connection but also the complexities of their behavior and intelligence that resemble those of humans. The understanding of this genetic relationship has been fundamental for studies in evolutionary biology, anthropology, and genetics, providing valuable perspectives on human behavior and social evolution. This genetic connection manifests its similarity in physical and cognitive aspects. Orangutans display a range of complex emotions, problem-solving abilities, and tool use, reflecting capacities that are traditionally considered distinct human traits. Additionally, the social structure and familial interactions of orangutans offer intriguing parallels with human societies, including prolonged parental care and social learning. Research into orangutan genetics has revealed not only their closeness to humans but also the genetic diversity within orangutan species. This diversity is crucial for their survival, providing the ability to adapt to environmental changes and resist diseases. However, it also underscores the vulnerability of these primates to the rapid loss of habitat and direct threats posed by human activities. Therefore, the conservation of orangutans and their habitats is a matter of global importance with implications for preserving our shared genetic heritage and the planet's biodiversity. Moreover, the genetic similarity between orangutans and humans raises important ethical questions about our treatment of other living beings with whom we share such close evolutionary ties. Recognizing these deep connections should inspire greater respect and consideration for orangutans, reflecting a commitment to protecting their well-being and the natural environment they occupy. Finally, the study of the orangutan genome offers unique opportunities for medicine and science, including understanding human genetic diseases and developing new treatments. By preserving orangutan populations and their genetic diversity, we can ensure that this invaluable resource remains available for future research that could benefit both orangutans and humans. The genetic connection between our species underscores the interdependence of life on Earth and reinforces the importance of living in harmony with nature. Number 5. Limited Geographic Distribution Orangutans are fascinating primates that, despite their vast intelligence and sophisticated capabilities, have an extremely limited geographic distribution confined exclusively to the islands of Borneo and Sumatra in Southeast Asia. This geographic restriction makes them uniquely vulnerable to threats facing their habitats, such as deforestation, wildfires, and land conversion for agriculture, 
particularly for palm oil plantations. The limited distribution of orangutans means that any change in their environment has a direct and often devastating impact on their populations. As the biodiverse rich tropical forests are cut down or degraded, orangutans lose not only their food source but also their home, resulting in a decline in their numbers and the fragmentation of their populations. Habitat fragmentation hinders the mobility of orangutans between different areas, which is crucial for genetic diversity and the health of the populations. The islands of Borneo and Sumatra are home to three species of orangutans, the Bornean orangutan, Pongo pygmaeus, the Sumatran orangutan, Pongo abali, and the recently discovered Tapanuli orangutan, Pongo tapanuliensis. Each of these species faces its own unique challenges, though all share the common threat of habitat loss. Their limited geographic distribution also means that any catastrophic event, such as an extensive wildfire or an outbreak of disease, could have potentially irreversible consequences for their survival. Additionally, the dependence of orangutans on dense primary forests for their feeding and nest building highlights the critical importance of conserving these ecosystems. They are highly reliant on a rich mosaic of forest resources, making the conservation of large areas of intact habitat essential for their survival. Effective conservation of orangutans, therefore, requires not only protecting individuals and their populations but also preserving the ecological integrity of their forest habitats. The conservation status of orangutans and their limited geographic distribution serve as an urgent call to action to protect the remnants of Southeast Asia's tropical forests. This is not only crucial for the survival of orangutans but also for the preservation of biodiversity and ecological stability in the region. Protecting orangutan habitats also benefits many other species that share their environment and depend on tropical forests for their survival, underscoring the importance of holistic and multifaceted conservation efforts. Number 4. Endangered Species Orangutans, magnificent inhabitants of Southeast Asia's jungles, are classified as critically endangered, an alarming situation that reflects the severe threats they face. There are three species of orangutans, the Bornean orangutan, Pongo pygmaeus, the Sumatran orangutan, Pongo abali, and the most recently identified, the Tapanuli orangutan, Pongo tapanuliensis. Each species inhabits specific areas of the islands of Borneo and Sumatra, and all face similar pressures from deforestation, poaching, and habitat fragmentation. The primary cause of their decline is habitat loss, driven by agricultural expansion, especially for palm oil production, as well as logging, both legal and illegal. Wildfires, often used to clear land for agriculture, have also devastated large swaths of their habitat. These practices not only reduce the area available for orangutans but also fragment the forests, isolating orangutan populations and hindering their ability to find mates, food, and shelter. Poaching and the illegal animal trade remain significant threats to orangutans, despite laws prohibiting these practices. Young orangutans are particularly vulnerable to the illegal pet trade, a cruel reality that often involves killing the mothers to capture the infants. Additionally, orangutans are hunted in some areas for their meat or in retaliation for invading agricultural crops, a problem that worsens as their natural habitat shrinks. The recent discovery of the Tapanuli orangutan, with an estimated population of fewer than 800 individuals, highlights the region's rich biodiversity and the urgent need for conservation action. These primates, on the brink of extinction, represent not only the loss of a species but also the erosion of genetic diversity, crucial for the resilience and adaptability of orangutans to environmental changes and diseases. Conservation efforts to protect orangutans are multifaceted, involving the protection and restoration of their habitat, combating the illegal wildlife trade, and awareness and education programs to foster peaceful coexistence between humans and orangutans. 
The conservation of orangutans is a complex challenge that requires coordinated action at local, national, and international levels. The survival of these extraordinary beings depends not only on protecting the last refuges of primary forest but also on transforming agricultural and economic practices to ensure a sustainable future for both orangutans and the human communities that share their habitat. Number 3. Advanced Tool Use Orangutans are known for their extraordinary ability to use tools, a skill that underscores their advanced intelligence and adaptability. This prowess places them in the select group of animals that not only use tools but also modify and select them specifically for various tasks, evidencing a level of complex thinking and planning. In the wild, orangutans have been observed using sticks to extract termites or honey from hives, showing an intuitive understanding of the basic principles of the tool as an extension of one's own body. This ability is not merely instinctive but also involves learning and knowledge transmission. Young orangutans learn to use tools by observing their mothers and other adults, a process that can last several years. This cultural transmission of skills is fundamental to their survival and adaptability in diverse forest environments. In addition to using sticks to obtain food, orangutans employ leaves in ingenious ways. They have been seen using large leaves as umbrellas to protect themselves from the rain or as gloves to handle spiny or prickly fruits. These behaviors evidence not only problem-solving ability but also an understanding of the future as they prepare and use tools in anticipation of specific needs or situations. Another notable example of their tool use is the modification of branches to create blowers, which they use to amplify their breath and produce unique sounds. This creative use of tools for communication reflects the complexity of their social world and the importance of interaction and mutual understanding within their communities. The use of tools by orangutans also has significant implications for understanding human evolution. By observing these skills in our close relatives, scientists can gain valuable insights into the origins and development of technology in the evolutionary history of primates, including humans. The ability of orangutans to use and modify tools underscores cognitive continuity between humans and other animals and highlights the importance of conserving these species and their habitats, not only for their intrinsic value but also for what they can teach us about ourselves and our own natural history. Number 2. Important Ecosystem Engineers Orangutans play a crucial role in the health and maintenance of tropical forests, acting as ecosystem engineers. Through their frugivorous diet and seed dispersal behavior, these primates contribute significantly to forest regeneration and biodiversity. By consuming a wide variety of fruits and transporting the seeds to different locations through their feces, they facilitate the germination and growth of many plant species, some of which depend almost exclusively on orangutans for their dispersal. This ecological service is vital for the long-term health of tropical forests, as seed dispersal ensures the genetic diversity of plants and the ecosystem's resilience to environmental changes and disturbances. Orangutans, therefore, not only consume resources from the forest but also actively contribute to its renewal and sustainability. This role as seed dispersers is especially critical in areas affected by deforestation or other environmental impacts, where vegetation regeneration is essential for ecosystem recovery. Additionally, orangutans' preference for certain fruits and their movement through large areas of the forest favor cross-pollination, another essential process for plant reproduction and species diversity. By feeding on flowers and moving from one to another, they can transfer pollen and facilitate fertilization between plants from different areas, contributing to the genetic health and variability of forest ecosystems. The importance of orangutans as ecosystem engineers underscores the interconnection between species and their environment. The loss of orangutans would not only be the extinction of an iconic and deeply intelligent species but also a blow to the functionality and resilience of tropical forests. 
Protecting orangutans and their habitats is, therefore, an investment in the health and future of global forest ecosystems. Conservation of orangutans and their ecological function requires a comprehensive approach that addresses the underlying causes of deforestation and habitat degradation, such as unsustainable agricultural expansion and illegal resource exploitation. Promoting sustainable forest management practices and reforestation with native species are critical steps toward restoring orangutan habitats and preserving the ecosystem services they provide. Through joint conservation, research, and education efforts, we can ensure that orangutans continue to play their vital role in the dynamics and health of tropical forests. Number 1. Emotional Intelligence At the pinnacle of orangutans' fascinating traits is their remarkable emotional intelligence, a quality that demonstrates not only the complexity of their cognition but also the depth of their social interactions. Orangutans are capable of experiencing and expressing a wide spectrum of emotions, from joy, sadness, fear to compassion, reflecting an emotional capacity often considered exclusively human. This emotional intelligence is evident in how they care for their offspring, in interactions between individuals, and in their ability to adapt to complex or new situations. The upbringing of orangutan offspring is a prolonged process, where mothers teach their young not only survival skills such as food foraging and nest building but also social and emotional norms. Mothers and their offspring establish a deep bond, characterized by constant care, protection, and teaching, which underscores the importance of emotional intelligence in the development of young orangutans. Social interactions among orangutans, although less frequent than in other great ape species due to their solitary nature, also reveal emotional complexities. Encounters can range from territorial competition among males to playful and affectionate interactions between known individuals, each requiring an understanding and appropriate emotional response. The ability of orangutans to communicate emotions and moods through facial expressions, gestures, and vocalizations is crucial for these interactions. The adaptability of orangutans to different situations also speaks to their emotional intelligence. They have been observed using tools in innovative ways, adapting to habitat loss, and finding solutions to new or unexpected problems. This ability to face challenges demonstrates not only cognitive intelligence but also the ability to manage emotions like frustration and perseverance. Finally, the emotional intelligence of orangutans highlights the deep connection and similarity with humans, reminding us of the importance of protecting these sensitive beings and their habitat. The preservation of orangutans and the tropical forests they inhabit is not only a matter of biodiversity conservation but also of respect and empathy toward a species that reflects many of the deepest aspects of human nature. The conservation of orangutans, therefore, transcends the protection of a species. It becomes a reflection of our own value toward intelligence, emotion, and life on our planet.